All right, it's the Big Ten Conference opener for a couple of teams, Iowa and Penn State, the beginning of a frantic, fantastic, frenetic pilgrimage to pay dirt for one of these teams on the season. Penn State trying to exercise and expunge its demons from last year's nightmare, and it starts today against the Hawkeyes. The kickoff coming up next. He's averaging 157 yards a game. Iowa won the toss, electing to receive. And this one is knocked out of the back of the end zone by Dave Kimball. Let's go down. Third down and three for Iowa. Banks with time, wide open to tight end Dallas Clark with a first down to the 42-yard line. Tackle. Banks in the flat complete. That's Brown with room. Brown knocked out of bounds at the three-yard line. Brown and Jones put to the bottom of your screen. Banks rolls their way. Touchdown, Hawkeyes. Jones on the catch. Effective and good-looking opening drive for Iowa. First down and ten for Zach Mills, who is sacked back at the 11-yard line. But I'm refusing. Russell getting to the edge. Fred Russell in space with a first down out of bounds at the 47-yard line. And in comes Kading to attempt the field goal from 47 yards out. Eight of between 40 and 49 yards. And he nails this one to give the Hawkeyes a 10-point advantage. First and 10. Mills the pass. Johnson brought down immediately in a fumble. The Hawkeyes have the ball. In the red zone at the 17. Second down and 12. Russell. Look at him shoot. Russell. Touchdown, Iowa. The Hawkeyes came to play today. Back. Beside the quarterback, and here he comes on to reverse. He's looking to throw it, and he is rocked. Back at the 37-yard line by Kevin Worthy. Pass in there was Michael Robinson. First time they've looked to do that this year. Mills downfield, and it's picked off by the Hawkeyes. Thanks. Has a man, Clark. First down at the Penn State 22-yard line. Dallas Clark, the former walk-on. Down and nine. Penn State blitzing into the end zone for Hinkle. Touchdown! He caught it! A 22-yard strike. And great catch. The point, did he have a foot down? And it's blocked. Derek Walker got penetration for the Nittany line. I don't like to see a defensive team be that penalized for a pass interference. Mills fires. They're going to say it's complete near mid. Not working against them here in the first half. That's the tight end, Casey Williams. The 28 yard line. Mills looking at the out and up pattern. Has Johnson. What a catch! Touchdown, Penn State. Oh, my God. I'm changing my name after the ball game. Russell brought down behind the line of scrimmage. They run the zone play into the boundary. Russell brought down at the 22-yard line. We've got a timeout on the field, and we'll be right back. That's Russell, and that's exactly what they do. Russell, not thinking about Penn State timeouts, though, huh? What about that, Bob? Out for the first down at the 36-yard line. First and 10, Banks back to pass. Has Clark. Clark still on his feet and finally brought down at the 37-yard line. And now, I was thinking about perhaps a field goal. 55 yards out. Plenty of leg on this. It's good. 13 consecutive field goals for Kading. And that's a career long. And what a play to take into the locker room for Kirk Ferentz, the head coach of the Iowa Hawkeyes. It's a game of inches, and that time 
Well, the bounce just happened to go the Hawkeyes' way. For the ball to 36 for the offense. Flag down, little waggle. Banks. Picked off. By number 23, Sean Mayer. The big rival, third down and nine. Mills for Johnson. Complete at the 32-yard line, Tony Johnson. And Johnson lining up out of the eye. Mills going up top. Complete to Brian Johnson at the two-yard line. He was working on Ant Larry Johnson. Touchdown, Nittany Lions. It's blocked. And a chance maybe for the score off the extra point. It's T.J. Johnson. No flags on the play. Derek Pagel came in and blocked it. Banks pulled it back and then hit Dallas Clark. Third and four for Iowa. Complete for the first down. Brown still on his feet. Nobody between him and the end zone. Touchdown, Iowa. 54 yards for the score. Boyer gets off a high spiral. Hinkle at the 35. Hinkle, got a block. Got Royer to beat. Hinkle all the way back to the 10-yard line. Incomplete and picked off. Brian Scott with his first interception off of the hands of Dallas Clark, who would have had a touchdown. Mills sacked back at the 10-yard line. Let's take one. And down in 18, Mills. Picked off. And this is coming back to the one-yard line. Jade Johnson. The 5'9 freshman picks off Mills and takes it all the way back. Banks hands it off to Russell. And it's on the ground. Penn State saying they have it. Still waiting for the official signal, and now it comes. Downstairs to Holly Rowe. Guys, you talk about every comeback having a turning point, but right now, Zach Mills has taken so many hard hits from this Iowa defense. I don't know that he's got it left in him right now. As he jogs to the sideline, you notice every time he's hurt, he's banged up, he's gingerly walking, and right now he has not got a lot of energy, guys. He's taken a brutal beating today at the hands of this Hawkeye defense. And I think Hawk 58 to go. First down and 10 for Penn State. And the shadows of its own goalpost back at the 8-yard line. Mark Jones along with Bob Davey and Holly Rowe down in the field. A surprise brewing today. Here's Larry Johnson on the screen. Johnson brought down after a nice pickup out to the 33-yard line. Ducks as they have as, as they had been coming in. Wide open. Casey Williams to tight end all the way down to the 48 and the first down. Well, and that's enough negatives to, to bring that football team back to reality. Here's the screen pass to Johnson. Got a good block on the kick out. Johnson. Touchdown, Penn State. Mark, think of the last four throws that Fran Ganner has had Zach Mills make. They've Real receiver set. Front down, 12 from the wrong 32. Calling for Wake. Nickel. Brown. Jumping up and down here at Beaver Stadium. Banks on third down. Back to pass. He's in trouble. Good far side. Stewart is there. And Stewart takes him down at the line of scrimmage. And he shanks it. At the worst possible time. Down at the 45 of the Hawkeyes. Mills, touchdown! 44 yards! Mark by the short control passing game. This is the best football he has thrown all day. The home run over the top to Tony Johnson. But I go back to Fran Ganner 
giving him confidence early in the football game. You see Tony Johnson up over the top, but a great throw on the freshman Joe. They run it with Gaynor, following Jimmy Kennedy, two point conversion good! 35, 28! High five the pound in Beaver Stadium, the Mitty Lions now really turned up the throw. A little more to go this time. Banks. Wisely throws it out of bounds. And Penn State's going to get another opportunity. Continuing to grow. Play fake. Mills complete to Larry Johnson. And a first down at the 46-yard line. I think you're going to see that coolness of Zach Mills right here in this late-game situation. First and 10. Mills finds the tight end, Casey Williams. Another first down to the 23. The miracle maker, Zach Mills, at work again. A pickup of 23 yards. Iowa double covering the wide receiver. Second down and 10. The slant complete. Johnson with a first down at the eight yard line. He was working on Javon Johnson. Looks like a different quarterback since Fran Ganner went to the ball control passing game when it looked like he was really preparing for next week's game instead of this week's game. But the resiliency of big-time players, the resiliency of a Zach Mills to regain his confidence. In my 30 years of coaching, first and goal for Zach Mills and the Nittany line offense. The fade. Oh, touchdown! Brian Johnson! That's why the number seven jersey is the most popular selling jersey in the entire area. We'll be back overtime right after this. First and 15. Penn State coming with a blitz. Complete. At the 19-yard line to Maurice Brown. A passing situation. Mo Brown runs the out cup. Cut. I'm not sure he had possession of that football. Run out of the eye. There's the jailbreak screen. Brown. And now Jones down to the eight-yard line. Today on third down. Banks. Touchdown, Jones. The moxie, the poise, the depth. Little screen pass to Johnson. Johnson with a nice gain and a first down. Mills under pressure. They're going to say it's out of bounds. Ooh, that was, that was a close. great effort right there. Very close. One official rules Tony Johnson caught the ball. The other. The same one who ruled Mo Brown drop a catch said Johnson bobbled it. Mike Robinson in the ball game. They fake it to him. And a great open field tackle that time on Casey Williams. Mills looks the other way. Incomplete. That's the ball game. The Hawkeyes storm into Happy Valley and steal one from the Nittany Lions in overtime. They withstood an incredible 23-point comeback by Penn State to hang on. And they've now won three consecutive times, four out of five, against Penn State. Meanwhile, on the other sideline, Joe Paterno suffering his first loss of the season as they fall to 3-1 and one on the year. Brad Banks, the quarterback, leading his team back in overtime. The final score, 42 to 35. Yeah, they'll be doing the hokey pokey tonight in Iowa City. That's their tradition. Final score, 42 to 35, Iowa over Penn State for Bob Davey. And Holly Rowe, I'm Mark Jones, Chris Fowler. Pressure's nothing but something you put in tires, right? <laughs>
ok mark welcome to our college game day